realized that some of them too can be grass as they get a little bit uh, further out of the water. And so the crates are filled with different habitats. There's some that are like old oyster shells, old clam shells, clean sediments, and it's partially to provide habitat for uh, fish and shrimp and uh, marine organisms. So I'll show you that. And then also these the grasses, these are all Marsh grass here, and uh, as you see, they're doing real very well. So, can we, we experiment a little bit too? Some of these are like these aren't don't have much sediment at all. It's basically just root straight in the water. Mm -hmm. This part has a couple of inches of sediment. This one we're putting in. Uh, the smaller ones were just planted this year. That's why they're smaller. Uh, but these have actually grown tremendously. They were last year. They're probably about that tall. So they, they came back. Nutrient removal, um, but you know, plants do the thing. So it's very good. And this sort of work. This little crab? Nice. So, uh, I'll just pull one of these out. Yep. Look at the little ones. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> Maybe some eagles too. Little glass eels. This crate just has some rope in it, which is sort of people use this to imitate eel grass, which was once mm. really all around New York Harbor, but it's become actually kind of difficult. To subsist, and uh, so there's still some fish in here. You guys see them? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oyster shells as well. So I'll just put them back. And, uh, so, not too much. So, we got three fish that came out, plus, oh, actually, there's some really smaller ones as well. And those are all shrimp. Yeah, grass shrimp. Mm -hmm. They're very tiny. Those aren't full, full grown. They'll be about twice that size. Oh, yeah, that's good. Yeah, they're just small fish, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and there are a couple of small fish as well. So, yeah. sometimes, like last year we had, there was one I pulled out and there was like 140 shrimp in it. Oh, my God. Um, mm -hmm. So, the water is actually pretty good. Well, more, I had a gross. Yeah. These are, these are all fish. <coughs> Right naturally, they would obviously be 
grasses naturally have all these rib muscles at the base of them, and then the side of the whole thing the roots. Did you line the, 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 the containers that had the soil in them so you wouldn't lose the erosion? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Exactly. Um, but some of them, so some of them have, like you'll see like this one. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, so that's right. got a good, it's, 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 I just put the plug on top. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, that's true. That's right, yeah. Wow. Awesome. <laughs> Oof. Yeah. Mm. Hydrogen sulfide. Yeah. Mm. It's sort of holding. I mean, it is. It does have some. Love it. it. Reminds me of, of my childhood. <laughs> it actually really does, and it's a sad thing when I actually took that into account. Like, that, what does it say about my childhood? Where did you? Uh, yeah, I grew up here. <laughs> <laughs> Driving by, and driving by mm. here. The bar, they still have yeah. the air. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. And um, are those, those, those are the fish. So sometimes it's open. But uh, it's actually one of the reasons we chose this for the dock. Bless you. Because it's not, it's not navigable mm. back here, so there's no active boats going back. Water, and because it's not in the main channel, it's much more protected. So yeah, it's a really good spot. There's not a lot of wave action. A certain number to. No, so they, if you build a dock under 200 square feet, you don't need a permit from the state. If you never square feet, you get into all these issues of fishing. They survive from that water for 180 square feet. And everything else, we didn't, if there's certain, if we wanted to like seed oysters here, we would have to get a permit. But the only thing that we actually planted was just the Plants. Oh, yeah. no, no, no. So nothing required. Yeah, no, that. yes. yes anything else yeah, there? Yeah. yeah. Like Brad said, you build it. Yeah, I'm in the graduate program. Mm -hmm. okay. yeah. well, yeah. The creek has lost all this habitat. Yeah. You know, all those inner tidal areas have uh, been replaced with these seeded uh, 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 lumber uh, bulkheads, so they've lost a lot of that shallow water area. Mm -hmm. So I was there, and he, he was doing this whole job. Yeah. I was just yeah, there. Just the water. And, uh, mm -hmm. so, you know, I knew we got things over the years. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 